light for the environment part. This is indicating the light for the circulation part. And this one is for the for reducing the temperature. <coughs> this one to increase the temperature. This is same for the distillation tank. This one is the evaporating tank. And you can see here. It's a green one. It's a meter to measure how much the heating transform oil. You can see. Normally, the oil should be in, in a range of the 2 gig, but now it's too much. Okay, the back. And here is the temperature sensor. Here is a temperature sensor. And here, this is the temperature sensor. Uh, here is to reduce air. And if you want to reduce the air, you can uh, turn on it. And for this part is the, uh, the window to see how much uh, it's rising in the tank. And uh, here is the, also the, the pipe window to see the, the transfer from the distilling tank to the evaporating tank. Here is the meter for the vacuum. Okay, and this is the condenser. Here's the inlet for the water, the condenser, and here's the outlet. But normally, we just need the part. Uh, this valve is just for the testing. Uh, we, do, we will not send this valve to you as no need. You just uh, connect the part with this. Stainless cup is okay. I mean the plastic cup is the stainless cup. Stainless cup. And the distillation tank is same as uh, similar with the evaporating tank. And here's the outlet. Here's the inlet. We put the material here from the inlet and put the solvent from here, the top. Here. And uh, here is a water oil separator. This one can help you collect some essential oil from the distillation tank. And this part is the uh, to recycle to collect the the solvent for recycle the, the solvent. And this one, this tank is a water tank for the water recycle uh, the tank vacuum tank. Okay, before you operate the machine, you have made sure the wire connecting very well, uh, but for now it's, it's large. But you should connect the uh, three phases and the four lines. And uh, before, after you connect the wire, you should check the pump, the direction of the pump. It's the same with the arrow. On the pump, here is the arrow. The direction of the pump should be same with the arrow. If different, we have to switch T1 and T2 on the panel. And uh, okay, everything is ready. We can turn on the machine. 
for the exciting. It's for exciting. And set the temperature and turn on it. And we should make sure this pipeline is closed. And this pipeline is open. This pipeline should be closed. And also here should be closed. Here should be open. And here should be open. And here should be closed. You uh, can't finish our window bench. Sorry for this one, for this bus. No need to open for now. And that is no fear. We only uh, <coughs> open this valve when the temperature reach to the set temperature. Uh, of course, it depends on your technology. If you need the temperature reach to 70 degree, if the temperature reach to 70 degree, you can turn on this valve and uh, also turn on this valve. And after the distillation, maybe take two hours or three hours, also depends on you. Everything is finished, we can close the valve. Close the valve. Sorry, close the valve. 如果是说提取结束了,我这个碎的把这个关掉。OK, okay. after distillation, we can uh, we should close this pipeline for the valve, this valve, and close this valve, and also this valve for the condenser, and uh, also close this valve for the oil, water oil separator, and also close this valve. Uh, after closing this valve, we should stop, stop the distillation, and then turn on the evaporating heater. And also, we should turn on the vacuum pump. This this pump. Yeah, should turn on this one, and uh, turn on the vacuum and press the start button. Uh, also, we should make sure the outlet valve is the ball valve on the bottom. And we should turn on this valve, and the exciting will be transferred from this distilling tank to the filter, and then go to the evaporating tank. Uh, during the evaporating, we can just uh, open the, the bottom of the distilling tank and uh, take out the wastage and clean the this this filter. This stainless steel filter should be clean each bunch. Uh, and the size of your material should be no more than, no, 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 funny than 100 miles. And uh, this system also for energy saving. After evaporating, if you still want to use the heat source, we can open this valve and let the heat source to the distillation tank again and to reduce the heat energy. No, not that. Yes, uh, okay, as this system is energy saving, after evaporating, there are some heating source still left in the evaporating tank. If you want to use it, we can open this for valve and also open this for valve and the heating will be back to the distillation tank. We can reuse it again. Okay.